Mongolia is known as a country with vast rugged panoramas, rolling plateaus, and its great warrior, Genghis Khan. In many ways, the country is still entrenched in its historical past. But Mongolia is also leapfrogging its way into the digital future. 20 years ago, you could hardly make a call. But nowadays, you can do it on your mobile phone through Skype. This is the N21 primary school in the capital city, Ulaanbaatar. This government school was built 50 years ago, and for a long time, all lessons were taught the traditional way, with blackboards, papers, and pen. Today, thanks to an endeavor funded by the Asian Development Bank, the school has introduced tech-savvy ways to teach the young generation. Classes are now taught in an interactive manner, engaging the students more. Teachers were also given access to computers. Most teachers had no previous experience when it came to using computers. The program taught teachers how to use computers and develop online curriculums. The lessons are now uploaded to a website which the students can access. An e-library was also created where students can now access books electronically. Before, students searched for books they wanted to borrow manually and had to read hard copies. Today, the book's content has been digitized and it can be read online. And if students want to search for a book, all they have to do to find it is to type in some keywords. It all sounds simple, but in a school where not many students have access to computers and technology, these certainly go a long way. The students come from different backgrounds. Some come from the Gur districts or slum districts. The school gives them opportunities they do not have. The school also lends these small processors to students who do not own computers. And the ADB-funded project installed Wi-Fi in the school premises so these kids can access the net anytime. These are things many take for granted. But in a country which just recently made the transition to modernity, they're a giant leap forward.